worth of luck so far today. We're gonna try our second spot. Hopefully, it's it's really low. They'll I can get them here. It's real low. I'll be able to get something here. As long as I can avoid getting hung, that's my main concern. I'm tired of losing crankbaits. about six feet since the last time I was here. My goodness. <coughs> now nothing. At least ten times they've done this. Oh God, stay on this time. Oh, oh, I'm keeping tension on, that's why I don't like braid. Oh my God, whoa, that's my personal best gar ever. Get the dip net now. That's four foot long, man. It's a long nose. It's at least, these might be five feet. That thing is giant. Oh my gosh. He ain't gonna fit in that dip net. You're gonna have to do it just right. Oh. It's yeah, it's too small. Oh my God. He's, he's 50 inches. We're gonna have to get him away from the, if we get it, just wait, I'll tell you when, I'll tell you when. Not yet. That's my personal best, easily. My biggest is 40 inches. Oh my God. Whoa, man. I'm gonna let him completely wear down and then I'm gonna let you hold the pole and I'll do the dip net. I gotta let him cut her out. That's the only way to do it. He ain't done yet. Oh my God. No, I don't think we can dip that him. I need you to get me the one glove is left in that backpack in the front pocket. <coughs> no, you can't. There ain't no way. There's no way. I need you to get the glove out of the backpack first. There's no way I can hold him without the glove. No way, he'll cut my hands. Guys, this is the biggest gar I've ever seen. I got one. The other, the other one's in your other bag. It's in the very front pocket. break my line that's 50 pound line but it's right through his teeth I'm gonna grab him I'm gonna put that glove on and I'm just gonna grab him by the snout and do my best forget the dip net it's too small don't do it he'll he'll it'll lose it don't use the dip net don't use the dip net don't worry about the dip net don't use the dip net don't use the dip net don't use it I'm gonna grab him by the snout. When I get him completely puttered out, I'm gonna let you hold the rod and then I'm gonna grab him by the snout and pull him up as far as I can away. Guys, this thing is five feet long. It's a long nose. I'm gonna measure it, but he's at least 48 to 55 inches. God. Oh my God. 
Don't use the dip net. Don't worry about it. It's gonna, he'll get off with that thing. It's way too small for that. No, no, no. Do not use the dip net. No matter what, just don't use it. I'm letting him completely put her out. I gotta just pray he don't get off. See, he's not done. He's not even close. <sighs> it, the dip net risk losing it. I'm sorry. I'm not trying to yell at you. That dip net, there's no way. At first I thought, yeah, but no. He's twice as long as that thing. Okay, come here. I want you to grab the rod. Just hold it in place. Don't do nothing special with it. Don't reel in. Don't do nothing. Because he's not done. He's going to go eight and shit. <sighs> My God. No. Go ahead and hold it. Or give it to me a little longer. I hold it. Okay. All right, guys, we're going to get a measurement hold on this that, gar. Hold that. Fifty-five. Did you hold that? Yes. What is this one? Fifty-five. Fifty-five inches, guys. Okay. Oh, my God. <sighs> That sucks it ruined that crankbait. It was working so good. Put it in your camera. Oh, yeah, pull it. Well, how much the reel? I ain't gonna be able to. Yeah, you can. Okay, go ahead. Yeah. Pull. Pull. Guys. The camera. It's 50. Over 55. I can't. Yes, 55 good. inches guys 55 okay put the tape measure away and then show me holding it there's no way i can get that glove i don't think so cut the hook or something 55 inches man <laughs> it it broke my damn hook <laughs> 25 pounds 30 pounds Oh. Oh. Oh, it's not straight. It's, been oh, it's hard not to get him bent. And hey, you got a phone on you? Yeah. Can you pull up what the state record long nose is in weight? I'm gonna. It's gotta be damn close. Uh huh. Fifty-five inches. Yeah, then we can weigh it. Because we threw back a state record two weeks ago and felt stupid after we got home for our sh uh, spotted gar. We had it beat by an inch and a half. Don't turn it because I can see that deal. What type of gar? Long nose. Well, that is a big son of a gun. Yeah, it is. Yeah. If I wouldn't have had 50 pound braid, I would have never stood a chance. I had one broke me off a 50 pound braid. It was probably like and it was wrapped through his teeth, and I and I let him tire down on the bank for 10 minutes for him. Yeah. Then I had two gloves, and my crankbait broke off and then got hung in the glove. You can't hold these fish without gloves. <laughs> they will cut their armor will cut the crap out of you. Yeah, here's that crankbait was. Dark. Seven pounds is all it says. Okay. Go ahead and get the scale out, hon. Yep, 27 and, pounds. And change my battery. Where's the scale? Think he's gonna go this past year? Yeah, Tyler. Yeah. Yeah, I live by him. 199. Yeah. You gotta be kidding me, that's it. <laughs> that means I wasn't even close. That means the state record 60 damn inches. Probably. He was 55. Yeah, probably then. Gosh. I'm gonna double check it though. For I ain't sure gonna... I've seen one that big before. I mean, that don't, you know, state record would be on, what, eight pounds heavier? Golly. 
Yeah. 19 and 9. 19 and a half. You ain't even filming me. You need to change that battery. Go ahead and change the battery. I know I'm making you do a lot. But... Well, it's still working. Oh. It's still working. All right, guys, we did not get a state record. Definitely a master angler fish, though. 19.9. I'm going to attempt to hold this fish again using a glove with a crankbait on them. And then we're going to get this guy back in. We're going to at least try. I'd like to see him live. He's beat up from all flapping around on the rock. All right, guys. Pretty freaking heavy <laughs> for a while. Okay, you, is it good? Mm -hmm. Just hold it for about 20 seconds and I'll get it back. I'll be able to get the pictures from the video. Man. It's my personal best, that's all that that's matters. Cool. After the day yeah. we had, I deserved it. We got that's super cool. our thermostat was overheating in the van. We had to park it, walk back home, get in the Durango, and the computer's messed up network shuts off in the middle of driving just like once a day and it'll start right back up after two or three minutes it's weird just i, mean, I need to reset the computer i guess okay okay that's it. So need to put it back there, catch a 19 right, pound bed well my best crankbait's going now okay. that crankbait. damage the crankbait all right wilma's on a fish guys I remember 34 and a half inches is the record. I don't see it yet. I'm underneath it. I think it's a gar. Just let him wear down. <laughs> yeah. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, man, that was a four footer again. Jeez, man. Ow. That was a, is it? Oh, I thought it, I thought the lure flew out. Oh, no, oh wow, that's a he's four. It's another four footer, man. It's too big for. Eh, I might. What do you think? Uh, Maybe he might fit. Yeah, he'll fit. Dang, we, our gloves are. We are. We, we need gloves again. You got a paper towel? You can hold it with if you get it. Oh my God. No, your your crankbait did fly off. It's wrapped around. It just wrapped on his teeth. Your crankbait. I seen it. I seen it go out there. He's not even on anymore. Oh my God! It's just stuck in his teeth, man. Your I, I swore I seen your crankbait fly off. That's why I went backwards. Do that. That deal. Do the deal. All right, guys. I just got my personal best long ear, our long long nose, and Wilma just got her personal best long nose. It broke her crankbait off, and she literally reeled this damn thing in with just the line wrapped in its teeth, and she still managed to get it on. Your crankbait's gone. There's a paper towel. There's, there should be one glove somewhere. I got one glove on the ground. I'd say he's 40 something, 45. 45. 45 inches, 10 inches smaller than mine. 45 inches guys, Wilma's personal best gar, three minutes after mine.
All right, guys, Wilma with her personal best, long nose gar, 45 inches. So he's about 13, 14 pounds. Hold him up just a little bit. There you go. Man. You're too far. I'm zoomed though. All right, let me unzoom it. I'll get closer. Man, that's nice. Hold him up. Up a little more. There you go. My goodness. Okay, just hold that pose for about 10 seconds. This is a good to do it. Okay. Okay. So it's not really yeah. Easy. All right, guys, we're going to get her back in. We accomplished something today. We got two personal best. Pretty cool. It's hard. It ain't your fault. That's a big one. My goodness. Hold on a minute. Let me zoom. Oh, man. Okay. 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 What a giant, guys. Okay, go. There we go. And he's off. All right. Man. <clears throat> Goodness gracious. That was blind luck that you got him with no lure. My God. Yep. Short nose. <clears throat> Not close to even close to a record. <laughs> About 18, 19. down <sighs> yeah he's mid 20s nowhere near 30 though so we know it's not even close <sighs> can you cut can you get me the pliers All right, guys, spotted gar about 24, 26 inches. Not bad. All right, I'm going to get him back in. It's almost dark. I'm going to get a couple more. God, these gloves are so nasty. Pretty sad that I'm washing my hands in this nasty. 